We are so happy to have the friends of KET who've traveled in across the Commonwealth to be with us this evening. And I have with me right now, Dale Josie, who's the president of the Friends Board. Dale, you've been involved for many years. Tell us why. You know, when I first came to Kentucky, when I first relocated here, I was a, uh, st on staff at KET. And that was a long time ago. I think it was when Daniel Boone came through the gap, <laughs> probably, but, but seriously, it's been a while. And even after I left, you know, I started working with law firms, I kept coming back. Even when I was working in politics in Louisville, I kept coming back to the point where someone who uh, works at KET uh, asked me, he said, what are you still doing hanging around this place? <laughs> I can't get it out of my blood. This native New Yorker loves being here, loves what KET represents. I'm glad to be continuing part of the story. Well, we appreciate your support. We're so grateful to the Friends Board. You know, so you all are so committed in yeah. helping elevate Kentucky educational television all across the Commonwealth. Yes, yes. And we so appreciate your dedication. Absolutely. Thank you. You know, our board is made up of diverse members, people who are equally committed to KET, not only in terms of what, coming to the network center, but getting involved in their community. When, I look, when we look through the media clips, we see people reaching out into com the community and being active ambassadors. And if someone has an opportunity for one of our friends to come and speak, let us know. Our friends are ready to share the KET message. Thank you so much. And so tell us what they need to do right now, Dale. Well, right now they need to, to, to donate to KET <laughs> at KET.org, or you can also call or text GIVE to 1-800-866-0366. Speak to one of our friends, not in name only, but in personality and nature too. We are the friends of KET, and we look forward to hearing from you. Thank you. Thank you.